Hey guys, it's Nick from bonbonsai.com and today I'm gonna to giving you I'm gonna give you an introduction to bonsai tree growing. Really an overview. But before I get started, I want to tell you about my bonsai ebook. If you're interested in learning how to prune, trim, and sculpture bonsai, then make sure you go to the link above at bonbonsai.com forward slash bonsai book. Now you can also find that in the description. Moving on to the topic today, I'll start by saying that the art of growing bonsai is an ancient oriental tradition in which bonsai means tray gardening or tray planting. There are traces of bonsai in Egypt, Japan, and China, and it was considered that the miniature tree uh, would have concentrated the powers of the actual size tree. Actually, many people had bonsai just for medical uses. Pretty interesting. Like, put it on their you know, boat, go along with them. So bonsai require a lot of care, though. The branches, leaves, and roots need regular pruning to maintain the shape of the tree. Pinching is also required, and even the use of small wires to keep the branches growing in a certain way. Because the root system is very small, bonsai need to be watered regularly and properly. They are also very sensitive to excessive heat, which makes water evaporate quicker, sun, and the wind. Keeping bonsai in their shape is an uh, art, and there are different styles that apply to different types of bonsai. The basic five styles are formal upright, informal upright, cascade, semi-cascade, and windswept. I've covered these before. The cascade style is probably the most interesting to display, as the branches of the tree eventually reach a level below the base of the pot. For the Japanese, bonsai have an aesthetic beauty and are meant to evoke the spirit of the plant being used. This may include the use of rocks, mountains, or water uh, features to recreate the surroundings of the actual tree in reality. This also includes choosing the most appropriate bonsai for an environment. There are indoor and outdoor bonsai, and the Japanese place them to suit a certain space with a type of spirit. Not all bonsai should be, according to this tradition, displayed in any place. A bonsai is a very elegant tree to display outdoors, and it makes an interesting choice for an indoor spot. Get yourself started today uh, with a dwarf Japanese garden juniper, considered by some as the best bonsai for beginners, and enhance the appearance of some room or area inside. Now that's all for today. I'll be making tons of more videos, so make sure you subscribe and check out the link above, which actually will be in the description below. And I'll see you in the next video.